Hello. In the previous two video, I show you how to install, compile, and build the OpenCV version 4. You can download my slide from this URL. Also paste it inside my videos in the my YouTube channel. Okay. Uh, deep learning for counter vision for the first step we are going to use the OpenCV version 4 OpenCV version 4 for, uh, the version for the August 2018 it supports C++ 11 and it has a module for deep learning also some updates related to the hardware accelerator G GUI enhancement point cloud modules and tracking calibration distribution and so on. For compiling the OpenCV4, we use Visual Studio on Windows 10 64 bit. We download the OpenCV version 4 from the GitHub website. You need CMake Visual Studio 2017 Windows 10. And if you want to use GPU for deep learning framework, you have to use NVIDIA GPU like GTX 1080. Also, you need to install CUDA. First step for OpenCV version 4, download the OpenCV and OpenCV contribute from the GitHub. And create a build folder using CMake to generate the Visual Studio. Then put the path of the OpenCV contribute to the OpenCV inside the modules and generate again and create the OpenCV project file in order to open in Visual Studio. Then you debug, build the debug, build the release, and then finally build in a start. If you build in a cell, every file you need, you require to use the OpenCV will be inside the in cell folder and you can delete the other files if you want. You just need to copy the in cell folder. Set the environment variable inside the windows and add the path of your DLL to the windows path in order to not copy the DLL files. Then Config uh, your Visual Studio project in order to use OpenCV. Follow the steps for debug and release mode. Then run a simple program to test whether the OpenCV works and you can use it or not. Here the Visual Studio project that we created during the last two videos. And here the Visual uh, Visual C++ directory. You need to add these two folder path here, and also for the linker inside the input, you need to add lib files. For the release and debug, you need to separately put uh, these steps together, and then run your program, and you can see your result. OpenCV version 4 using C11. Uh, you need, if you want to develop new algorithm and put to the website, you have to follow the several rules in order your program and algorithm C file on the S style of the OpenCV project. For example, the file name must be all lowercase. And also, uh, you need to start uh, each class. Need to start with capital letter method and function almost a small letter. But if uh, the name of the method from the other, you can use capital letter. Macro enumeration all capital letter. HTML function you need to use. 
see export and so on okay now for other program that we want to use I create a class in order to put everything inside my class later on we can use and modify easily create a class the class name will be OpenCV OpenCV test okay Okay, now we run the uh, scissors. Okay. Now I'm going to show you how to use the cafe model in your program. First, you need to go and download several files from the web. First, you need to go and download three files. This one, the list of the object. This one, Google Net, the deep learning model based on the cafe. And this is the prototypes or model description. Then, inside your project, uh, write to function and the code. This code is based on OpenCV version 4. Maybe it doesn't run in another version of OpenCV. Okay, this is the code. After we download the file, I put it inside the folder in my project folder, deep learning files. This is cafe model. This is model description. This is one example images and this is the name of the all the object that this deep learning model training on. okay and here inside the our project this is the path of the file this is the classes in order to find the best model of the uh, best object and this is the name in order to read the name of the file and here I create a just one function here what deep learning cafe model this is for cafe and all this program based on OpenC version 4 okay a scale and some requirement this is the path of the cafe model this is the prototypes name of the object and example images and everything based on the code here we show the images and name of the class and probability of 
this object. Okay. Now we run the project. Okay, as you can see, this is a space shuttle and 99% accurate uh, confidence of this object.